Good morning, everyone. It is Saturday, January 8th, and I'm doing a studio vlog today. So don't have a super busy day, but I figured um, it would be a great day to vlog then <laughs> because of that. So come along with me. I just arrived. I'm parked and getting ready to walk in. day I filmed was Saturday but Sundays are family days and I don't usually work those days and then yesterday I was just doing admin stuff all day which I'm gonna be doing a lot of admin stuff today as well but I am gonna be pouring candles so I figured you might as well vlog the shop is closed on Mondays and Tuesdays Sundays as well obviously um, so these are my days that I obviously get to do production which I have a lot of production done already um but we could always be making more candles so i'm hoping that you guys can hear and see okay um i did order a mic for the camera so i'm hoping that that helps with the noise i do have like a mini split ac unit that can kind of pick up really loud on the camera so just bear with me for these videos um but i kind of wanted to show you my workspace so inside of my shop i do have my open workspace kind of like an open kitchen um where people can actually see where i make their candles i was really hesitant on doing this in the beginning when i decided to open the shop i was going to have my workspace in a separate building but when i had just the studio space and i would allow people to come do local pickups people loved seeing where the candles were made so i was like you know what i'm just going to add that element into the workspace i do the diy candle workshops in here as well we do sip and pour events um, and people just love seeing where the magic happens honestly so in my shop in the back corner here i do have my workspace i just have the stainless steel work tables which eventually i would love to upgrade these and to make them something maybe more a little bit aesthetically pleasing that kind of matches the rest of the furniture um but for now whatever it works i have my digiboils i just have some supplies back here i try to keep it pretty clean and tidy so yes it's open but um it's usually not a mess I have some poor pictures lined up here, which I don't really use these when I'm doing production for my brand. I really only use those um, maybe if I'm filming like video content or when we have our candle pouring events, those are the pots that I put the wax in and then I set them on their tables. Um, if you guys are interested in a video where I talk more about um, sip and pour events and hosting DIY candle workshops, let me know. I'd be happy to do um, a whole separate video on that as well. So in the back of my shop, we do have the garage door, which is awesome because this allows us to bring in packages and deliveries really, really easily. We don't really have to carry them through the courtyard, you know, through the front door. We just open the garage, 
load everything in, shut it, and we're good to go. I also love it for whenever we're like cleaning out. Um, it's just really nice to open it on a nice day and get some fresh air, kind of cleanse the space. So yeah, this is my little workspace area. I just kind of wanted to take a moment just to kind of share so that if you guys were wondering like, well, where is she at? Is she in the shop? Is she in her studio? We have it all combined in one here and it works really well for me. Um, but if you guys have any specific questions about my space, let me know and I'll definitely touch on it. of them so that's enough for the batch for my wholesale and then I'll have a couple that I can stock here in the shop and people can come purchase so yeah it is 11 o'clock I'm just doing some admin stuff working on my new website which I'm hoping to have up by February but it's been a lot harder designing it um, than I thought it would be I've been doing all of it myself so yeah that's been interesting but getting ready to go grab some lunch i have a package that is supposed to be arriving from porter candle supply which i'm really excited um, i'm using one of their new scents and then i bought a whole bunch of samples so that i can do a video review so stay on the lookout for that if you're interested give this video a like gonna label these Say hey, D. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Today is Thursday. We are back at the shop. I've got D here today, and we are pouring a ton of candles. So we are getting ready to do a big batch of our Good Vibes candles. We're trying to get all our shelves stocked and a lot of our production done. Um, we did a lot of in-person events last year. We do get, plan to do the same thing this year and those start in the spring. Um, and we're just trying to get ahead of the game, have stock for the shop as well as that we can take um, to events, which we do have a couple that we plan to do um, hopefully in February. So we'll have lots of inventory and just trying to get ahead of it because last year I felt like we were doing events and then we would have to turn around and pour a ton of candles because we were selling out almost every single weekend. So just trying to make it to where we have lots of inventory and stock ready to go so we're not having to pour as much or every week once our busy market seasons begin. So we're doing a big pour today. I am also just getting ready to stock some supplies. We got business cards back in. We do these cute little square cards for our business cards. We actually get these from Next Day Flyers. I designed them in Canva. And then I just recently redesigned our care card. So we had a care card before and it just looked a little bit different. So this is the new care card. And then on the back, we just have thank you. Just a little note from us and um, we keep looking at the viewfinder and I need to look at the camera. I'm trying to get used to this. Um, there is a discount code so you can take a picture of your order. We encourage everyone to and share it, tag us, and then they can also 
get a small little discount whenever they do an online order. So this just is our new card. So I'm stocking those and yeah, that's about it. Today is Saturday and normally I would be at the shop doing shop things but we actually had some storm last night and we had some maintenance things that need to get done today so we just decided to shut the shop down. So I'm just working from home today. Um, I'm actually trying to finish up our new website. I'm actually pulling down our current website because I'm in like the final stages of getting ready to upload it um, and switch everything over. So. Yeah, I'm just working on stuff that I really can do at home. Um, I would prefer to be at the shop working, but it's whatever. Um, so yeah, not much going on today, just working on that, doing some email list things, and then I am going to be on Clubhouse this afternoon for kind of like a makers reunion chat session. Um, I used to be on Clubhouse heavy, like loved that app. Um, have met so many amazing business owners on there. So I'm definitely excited to be on there. Um, so yeah, hopefully some of you who are watching it will be in the room today and we can chat more. But I'm going to use this as like the ending of the vlog for this week. Um, I'm sure it was maybe too long, maybe not long enough. Let me know your feedback in the comments what you think of these studio vlogs. Are there certain aspects of my business that you'd like to see more? Um, and yeah, I will be starting a new log on Monday and hopefully getting that uploaded for you guys to enjoy along with my Porter Candle Supply fragrance oil review coming soon. Have a wonderful, wonderful day or night, whatever time of the day that you're watching this, and I'll see you next time.